We Enter Kirchen in Munich. And um, I'm standing in front of the old 45 degree wall. But look at this, now it's brand new. I think we are the first human beings who touched this hold. And yeah, they rebuilt the whole stage here. Like they put two uh, kilter boards brand new in there. Some Everything is new. I mean, look around, it's crazy. I mean, for me, it's like a little bit pain in the ass. Why? Why is it so special for you? I mean, you know, I spent my, my whole youth here. Like, I trained like every day for hours in, in this uh, corner here. Now it's yeah. all different. How many days did you spend here? The only thing I can say, I spent over 50,000 pull-ups on this bar over there. When you remember the last time here in this gym? The last time here in this gym is... 2009, so 13 years ago. Yeah, you competed both in the in the European Youth Cup on the outside wall. There's like an outside lead wall. Crazy. You're getting old. I know. You're like <laughs> Youth A or something. Crazy shit. Do you remember this uh, this corner, this old 45 degree? I, I remember it very vaguely. I do remember the pull-up bar though, for some reason. <laughs> Alex, that's your warm-up. This is my warm-up. Ah, cool. You need it for the World Cup, right? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> this might be the start of the final, to be honest. <laughs> we need more beast makers. Why do you only have two, Chris? Because they love to go climbing instead of producing some <laughs> beast makers. <laughs> Okay, done for today. <laughs> nice. Kelterboard Home Edition, Kelterboard Original, that's all you need. And we are here to check it out, right? We are here to check it out. Tomorrow there will be the opening over here in Talkation Kletter Centrum and uh, we are checking that everything is in place. <laughs> we are like the, the USA for climbing walls. <laughs> <laughs> The Kilter Board Home Edition. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Yeah, some Enjoy. smaller holes. Not so many jugs. Yeah, in comparison to this one. In comparison to this one. <laughs> jugs only. Jugs only and tiny footholds. <laughs> yeah. Brand new board, slippery holds. Here we go. Next. Name. Like on the other Kelter board, first Negros Roller, no matching. Name Alexandros Negros. <laughs> Should I name it that way? Yeah. Okay. Name it Colossus. So Chris, what's what's the problem? The problem is, get the feet higher up here. Why don't you grab the second starting hold? <laughs> Makes it not even better. Huh? What, so what's the better now? And reach the fucking second hold. <laughs> 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 And 60. So pretty steep. Yeah. I heard uh, it goes up to 70. Yes. Then the top hole is here. <laughs> it's perfect World Cup preparation. <laughs> <laughs> Michael, 
Celtic, I think. Feeling ready for the World Cup? So ready, you saw how <laughs> ready I'm feeling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's hard also, it's I think 80 plus maybe. Only one cent. Alex, yeah? should I call the doctor? You have fever, right? <laughs> Something wrong with you. Oh, I get a crap in my foot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's hard. Actually hard. Your turn. Finger crack. That's not where the end comes from. The trick now. The trick is have bigger hands than you. And <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for nothing, Alex. <laughs> no, I think crack climbing is all about hand size. So if your hand fits perfectly, it's not so hard. If it doesn't fit, then it's really hard. Hey guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video about us testing the new Kiltaboard Home Edition. And uh, yeah, subscribe, um, write something in the comments. It's very important for us to get better on this stuff here. And um, yeah, see you soon, I hope.